Quarantine de Uno. Told y'all I was gonna track this. So, I'm cooking. I have mushrooms, I have onions, garlic, and a little bit of olive oil on the stove. And then over here, I just have my noodles boiling. These are whole wheat pasta noodles. They're just getting boiled until they are al dente. Some seasonings over here. Um, I cracked open a bottle of Roscato. I didn't get any Stella Rosa, but I'm probably gonna go get some Stella Rosa just because, why not? Um, and then, y'all, the ground beef is like all gone. So I had to get lamb at the store. And then I have hot sausage. And then I got Classico, cause this is the only one that was left. You know, I'm a little, I'm a chef that likes to have a little fun while they're chefing it up. So I have a little glass here. And then of course I was using this olive oil. So yeah, this is what's going on so far. After I'm done with this, I'm gonna add the lamb. I'm gonna cut this in half and add the sausage. And we're gonna get that going in here. And then by that time, the noodles should be done. I'm gonna drain the noodles and then put them in another bowl and then transfer this along with the cooked meat into this pot, add the sauce, and then we're done. Voila, we got spaghetti. So that's what's going on. Okay guys, here's the finished product. I'm just going to top mine off with some parsley. Parsley plate. Here's my spaghetti. I have some garlic bread in the oven and I'm watching Parks and Rec, so yeah, yeah. <laughs> yeah, yeah, but yeah, this is, <laughs> this is it. Doesn't it look delicious? Hello, it is day two of, I can't cook, but I can try. Yesterday was super easy, it was spaghetti. I feel like we can all, we can all master spaghetti, but today, Today is chicken fajitas. And then of course I have a quarantini. I'm going to making myself a little drinky de drinky. I need it. Stop. Here's some chicken that I've been thawing all day. Boneless, skinless chicken. I'm going to I'm sure this song is copywritten. I'm gonna put it in some water, I'm gonna clean it. We'll resume once it's clean. Alrighty, y'all. I got my drinkity drink. This is a passion fruit margarita. It's literally, hold on, y'all. It's literally this passion fruit mix, this tequila, and um, ice. Blend it up. And you have a margarita. I have some limes, so I'm probably gonna squeeze some fresh lime juice in there because, you know, I want it to be more authentic. But I have Southwest taco seasoning, so I'm gonna add a little bit of that to the chicken. Oh, y'all can't see. I'm sorry, I'm sorry. There we go. I'm gonna add a little bit of taco seasoning to the chicken breast, and then, what's next? I'm gonna add a little bit of salt. A little bit of pepper, and then a little bit of cumin, and a little bit of chili powder. Okay, y'all, I got some gloves, so I'm just going to work the seasoning into the meat. He wasn't just no homeboy chicken in no neighborhood. He was a pillar of the community who refused to accept the feet from those folk who kept saying, I bring one real. And then the song was in the group. Yes,
Okay, here's the finished product, you guys. This is what it looks like in the actual bowl, the chicken and the veggies and stuff. And then this is what the fajitas look like. And it's time for me to make another drink. Hey guys, good morning. It is, what time is it? It's early, it's 10.30. Um, I mean, it's early to be out of the house. I'll tell you that. I needed to get my hair done. Um, I have a couple of wigs that I needed to get installed. I was gonna try to install one of them myself, but TJ was like, just bring both of them in. Um, I haven't seen TJ, when's the last time I got my hair installed by TJ? Was it LaToya Logan? The LaToya Logan wig? Was it? I haven't seen TJ in a month. So, just waiting for TJ. But, I mean, other than that, like, I got food at the house. Um, I've just been... just been chilling. I've just been chilling. So, oh, y'all. Such an awkward time. I'm hoping that this doesn't last too long. I feel like... I'm not selfishly ready for this to be over. I'm ready for this to kind of like, uh, I guess, I wish there was like an answer. Um, I was listening to The Read um, with Crystal and Kid Fury, and they were comparing it to like hurricane season or tornado season, you know, when you have a definite like time frame of, you know, when this is going to like hit, and then you can kind of, figure the aftermath after that but like with this everything is just so up in the air which is why I'm just ready for things to kind of like settle down because I really want people to be able to go back to work um there are just a lot of people from people that work at daycares um to people that are servers people that are in the entertainment industry like not in like you know exotic dancers and things like that like every industry is being hit so hard by things just shutting down there's a lot of things that need to be done for us to function globally and i think this is my first time ever experiencing a pandemic like this where we hey boo <laughs> where we have to slow down so much that um you really see how much of our lives are based on interacting with other humans okay there are bugs out here so i'm gonna get out of my car and i'm gonna book it i'll see y'all later beautiful Yay. party people yesterday had leftovers but today is a new day. It's a new day. And what we're gonna do today, we're going to make skillet chili with cornbread. Of course he used ground beef. I don't have that. Y'all took it off. So, ground lamb. It's a go. It's a go. We're gonna put it in my cast iron skillet and then we're gonna finish it in the oven. Watching Step Brothers because it's like one of the best movies ever made. Let's get it. sour cream but there's like a crumb left so I think I'll just save it but here she blows hi y'all 
So today is Friday. I just filmed this look for you guys. So keep a lookout for that. It's just like my everyday makeup routine. Because I received a comment that somebody left and she was just like, hey, can you film your everyday makeup routine? Because I looked up Ashley Devon, Ashley D Beauty, Ashley D everyday makeup, couldn't find it. So I was like, okay, sure. So I'm about to curl my hair and then probably run and get some groceries. I'm about to wand curl my hair. It is 36 freaking inches, dude. Way too freaking long. <laughs> okay, so I have to do my baby hairs. My little swoopy swoops. Okay. And then come over here and do these swoopy swoops. Got my swoopy swoops done. That was fast. Um, I have my little band, my little scarf. It's a scarf. It's not a band, it's a scarf. I think I got this scarf from like Forever 21 like ages ago. And then I found out I could use it as like a head scarf to tie my baby hairs down. And I've just been doing it like that ever since. So. Just literally tying my swoopy swoops down. Ugh, so I can go in and warm curl this hair. Oh my gosh, y'all. This is a lot of hair. Two wand curl. I was looking at the footage when TJ did my hair and it took him 23 minutes to curl my hair. Ugh, to curl all this freaking hair. So I'm starting with the top. I'm gonna wrap it around and then I just place my hands on it until it's like too hot to touch and then release it and then there's like a little wand curl so I'm just about to do that literally all over my head <laughs> Here's what it looks like. I warm curled all of it. So yeah, now it's time to put my outfit on. So I take off one black shirt to put on what? Another black freaking shirt. Um, the outfit that I put on is like, is really cute. I think I feel like I can do a little bit better 
but I really need to take like an IG picture and I have on this like t-shirt and I have on these like leather pants with my black purse. Oh, she's so cute. Okay, let me film this intro so that I can go. All right, people, what is up? Cinderella OG is here. Doesn't want to be seen. I mean, neither do I, quite frankly. But <laughs> I am giving you the what? The real. I'm going to move these robes right here. I'm going to move those. Um, I have my little shower caddy thingy. And I'm going to play some music. Okay, so here is my lit early 2000s R&B and hip hop playlist. We danced to this for a step show. Oh my gosh, my jam. You guys, my makeup is Dunsies. Cindy's in the bathroom doing her face. She's on IG Live. But yeah, I'm done. I have a couple breakouts that um, I need to, to heal. But I'm sure using lactic acid serum will just get rid of that for me. Okay, so yeah, this is just like the everyday makeup routine that I showed you guys. Um, The lashes are from i technically have three lash drawers it's from my second lash drawer they're by omg i think they're wait they're by lash kitty oh sorry they're by lash kitty i think they're the fabu lash lashes this is the um the packaging i don't know if you guys can see that but um lash kitty combined with i mean collabed with omg lashes why aren't y'all focus 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 on the box boo come on baby there you go boo so you can see her youtube name her at name so yeah these are the lash kitty lashes they're a little uh, uh dramatic i'd say for my everyday look a little dramatic for me i gotta do my hair to see um but i might change the lashes i have some e11s well i have these these are the d383s by aliexpress i could use these but i need some lashes that are gonna like wisp upwards Ugh, these breakouts are bothering me because my face usually doesn't break out mm, okay I feel so much better now. I changed my lashes to the AliExpress D383 lashes. D383. Come on, baby. Come on, baby. Zoom in. There we go. There we go. There we go. Okay. This is honestly much better. This is the wispy look that I was going for. Excuse me. Let me take a little bit of my MAC powder. Put a little bit more under Neath my eyes. Oh, much better. Hey y'all, my hair is in the braid. Cause you know TJ applied my wig um, a couple of days ago, last week. He found my wig last week. So, I'm about to film my shower routine with the help of Cindy Rolla, Ella, Ella, A, A, A. I'm not Cindy Rolla. Ella, Ella, A, A, A. Uh, so, I'm just tying my little head wrap on. I was gonna put um my whatchamacallit on my um shower cap but since this is a simulation shower I don't need to do all that. Let me find a bathing suit. I have a whole drawer full of swimwear. Here it is. 
in all its messy glory. I'm never gonna organize it. So quit asking. Um, I have this this really cute bathing suit right here, and it's um this is actually really cute. I just need to find the top for it. It should be somewhere around here. Fun fact about me is that I absolutely hate bathing suits. I hate them. I despise bathing suits. Um, I hate bathing suits because they show off too much of my like inner thighs. It just shows too much in this area down here. And I don't, I just feel so uncomfortable with that area just like being out and being exposed. Um, you know, like... I won't say most black women because I don't know what black women deal with, but I deal with hyperpigmentation in that area just from like all those years of shaving before I like started getting waxed and stuff. So I hate bathing suits. I hate it. I hate it. I hate wearing bathing suits. So. Oh, hello, beautiful people. So I have an outfit on to take pictures in the kitchen so let me turn on all the lights watching broad city one of my favorite shows ever are you ready like a burn 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 i think we're gonna be taking a mug over here So I saw one that I really, really like, but I need to change. Which one was it? The one where I was like smiling and looking off. I thought it was super cute. But yeah, I want to- was great on that, that, that side though. Ooh, okay, we'll see what I want to look like I have body yaddy yaddy, so I have to change it to something that's body yaddy yaddish. I'll be alright. Body yaddy yaddy. Tell me love me. Because we're going to take one more round of pictures and then we're going to move on to another project. Productivity. Burr, 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 burr. We did. We did. Right, people. So, Cinderella just left. Um, we finished all the stuff we set out to do today. I'm super freaking excited. Today was such a productive day. I have honestly been like filming like crazy lately this 
super long wig is going to get taken off in a few minutes um like i said earlier i have a couple of breakouts like one right here one over here so i'm just going to be giving my skin a little tlc so today is monday um cindy's coming over um again on thursday so i might hold off on wearing makeup entirely until thursday in efforts to clear these two breakouts so probably that's something i'll probably do because i have enough content to post where i don't have to be like super duper present um on instagram or youtube for at least the next couple of days so i'm gonna go ahead and end the vlog here hopefully you guys liked this um i'm definitely going to be a lot more engaged and show you a lot more behind the scenes and stuff now that i'm um pumping up the volume and actually being productive and like taking you guys's oh that's better because i was tired of holding it <laughs> actually i'm gonna put it right up here okay because my arm was getting tired um yeah i asked you guys on instagram to give me um video recommendations i really just like want to pump up the volume sorry there's a hair on my face i want to pump up the volume and like um really tune in to you guys's requests and what you really want to see um and make sure that like i have my ear to to the streets and i'm listening to you guys and like truly giving you what you want so i'm really tired so kind of feeling a little bit low energy so i'm gonna go ahead and call it a night i'll see you guys next week on a toe by ashley thanks for watching love you guys oh.